this is what's going on in Abaco. Uh, these Haitian sloops are, are loaded and on the rail here, and boy are they loaded. Everything is like we got no uh, no law here. These stuff has had the whole dock lock up. We got a cold front, and boy, there's things going on these boats. Just want to give you an inside look at what's going on in Africa. The hurricane has made it lucrative. I'm talking about absolutely lucrative for the money grab of the stuff that's going to Haiti. Everything, everything is gone. Everything's going. And this is what you call big business here today. Big, big business as I bring it to the Bahamas of what's going on in my town. I am only the photographer. You guys decide. This is Abaco. And these boats could sink. I don't know where they're going with these mattress, boy, but they got plenty of mattress here. You sell a mattress, eh? Yeah, I sell it to you. You sell it to me? How much? Yeah. This fella, he's a salesman. He's selling the mattress to Kai. I don't want no mattress. <laughs> No mattress I want, uh, but plenty of mattress here. Generate! Yeah, we got generator going. We're looking for generator. Let me do a walk through. Somebody gonna be rich. The whole dock, the whole dock is full. They got generators. Everything here. I don't think about Haitian. They got, they're like Cubans. They'll fix anything. We got another generator here. I could use that generator. But boy, this boat don't look like a seaworthy, but it's. It's loading as Kai bring the video to you. And these chairs are new chairs, but everything is all wrapped and this boat is ready to sail. And um, I'm not going on this boat. This is the minister. This is the minister right here responsible for transportation. I know him. I know this little fella is Goldie. This boat over here is loaded, 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 loaded. Everything is gone. Where they got all this rope? Where they got all this rope from? This is big boat rope. Yama gone. Got some Yamas there. I don't know who the owners is, but they're gone. And I'm talking about a loaded, loaded boat. This boat is loaded. I mean, check this out. Mattress galore. This is the 17th day of January. And I don't know who owns this. This is a rich Asian. This is a big boat. See there are uh, the spoke coming of that. He's loaded and he's ready to go over here. Bicycle. Uh, it takes you forever to load this boat. But these guys got a loader. And load it quickly. Somebody say, look here, bring this stuff. And the stuff is here. And look at the mattress. Every mattress you could have claimed is in here. Huh? And old generators. I guess somebody maybe can make them work. All this wind. This is another boat. There's two boats. These boats are pretty big. I don't know who owns them, but they must have some money. Everything else. Plenty, plenty mattress. Somebody in Haiti is going to be sleeping good tonight. Tomorrow. They haven't reached yet? Okay. Uh, whenever they reach, boy, you got plenty mattress. Any of these generators working, I can use one of these. That blue one there, that blue one there, look like she is wakeable. 
Why is that that the aliens we could use it here in the Bahamas? Kai just happened to stumble on the most lucrative, it's like a gold rush where in the Haiti. Everything, it's a big boat, big boat. You see those small boats? It's about almost a hundred feet. And boy, when they get in Haiti, somebody's gonna be a millionaire. Um, I don't think I want to go to Haiti on this boat, but I don't mind visiting to see what's going on over there. But I don't want to spend too long a time in Haiti. But on top of that boat right there, they got to load it from the top all the way down. Washing machine. Yeah, the gas tank too. You yeah, can't just mind gas tank. What's the kind of mind gas tank? Everything is gone. My video, they're looking at me, boy, looking at me. They're going to tie me up. I better go here. Chainsaw. Now that's a brand new chainsaw. That one right there is a new chainsaw. It looks like one of my chainsaw. On the class, my chainsaw. I can't take video. I'm a videographer. Nice chair. That's a brand new chainsaw. You don't want me to take video. Nobody want me to take video. He and the Haitians don't want me to take video. I'm trying to make them a movie star. And he want to know why I take video. He, he stuff. We're only in the bottoms. Oh, these fellas get stuff. This, this is what I call stuff. They are loading stuff. Leave one of the mattress for me, please. Put me mattress. No Dundee. But this was going on here. And that's only the half. This is, this is where the money stuff is over here. These, these are stuff. Look like bales of marijuana, and they got these all bandage up. You don't know what's inside here. But whoever these belongs to took a lot of care in them. I'm just doing the video. 'round me trying to look inside here to see what's all inside here. Oh they got this one. This one is secure. This one is pretty much secure. Everything is here. I don't know who's the captain of these boats, but boy, they got stuff here. Man, this is the money grab. Check this out. Even the children uh, the school seat for the children from the primary school is here. Everything is here. Which one of y'all is the captain? You the captain? No. You look like a captain. You the older one. You the captain. You look like a captain. You look like you're seaworthy. You look like you spend plenty of days on the water. Ain't nobody want to be the captain. <laughs> This was going on here as uh, thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars worth of stuff is being taken off there. These two steel boats pulling early, one day loading. That one got a Bahama flag on it. I don't know where you got that from. That one ain't got no flag, but that one got a Bahamian flag on it. And all these stuff is fastly moving with Abaco. This is when you need the authorities to see if somebody, innocent person stuff, is being smuggled on there. That's two 90-foot uh, boats that's loaded to the gills. Now, my question is, if we just had a hurricane and everything is destroyed, where do these people get all these goods from to send to Haiti? Two 90-foot boat loaded to the gills where they got them stuff and where they were keeping them when the hurricane totally destroyed the mud obviously they're not getting them out the mud question where did they get them and who did they belong to 
I'll be here people don't care. They don't care. Uh, do what you want to do. This is the Bahamas. Do what you want to do. This one of these Kai Care videos here at the dock. The money grab.